Hi, I'm Carolyn from GlassEyesOnline.com. Hope you had a great weekend. Last week, I showed you how to order a product and check out as a guest. As you may have noticed, it takes a little longer if you check out as a guest. This week, I'll show you how to create an account to speed up your checkout, track your orders, and more. You'll sign in and out. You'll edit your contact information and you'll learn what to do if you forget your password. So let's get started. Here we are at the home page. You can sign in either in my account here or in login. So let's create an account. I'll click on my account and I want to create an account. So basically I've put in my name my email address, I can check off to sign up for the newsletter if I want, and I put in my password. And now I'm going to submit. Okay, it says thank you for registering with Glass Eyes Online. So this is the dashboard, the account dashboard that you're in. Here's where you can edit information. So if you sign out and then come back in, you can go right here to your dashboard, Select Dashboard. You can edit your contact information. So I click on Edit. Save. And you can also sign up for the newsletter here if you want. You would click this button here. And right over here, this little box here, you check that and you would be signed up for our free monthly newsletter packed full of great information. So right now I'm gonna leave that alone. Here's your billing addresses and you can manage those by clicking on manage addresses. You can change your address or you can edit your address. Okay, so that's the account dashboard. You've created an account. I showed you how to make changes to your account in the account dashboard and now Let's say that you forget your password and can't remember how to get in. You can log out right here. Let's say I want to log in. Okay, I've clicked on log in. It's asking me to log in with my email address and password. If I can't remember, I can click here, but I can't remember my password. Click on forgot my password and it will send you, you put in your email address here, submit, and it will send you an email to your email address with your uh, temporary password. Once you get in, you can go back to my account and it takes you back to the dashboard. Once you're in the dashboard, you can go back and change your password. So we've looked at creating an account, signing up for the newsletter, signing in and out, editing your contact information, and what to do if you forget your password. I hope you find this helpful. Stay tuned for mini tutorial number four, where I show you how to use the search bar. Have a good week.